Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth and uh, we have, we're at the second Mako reactor thing for the Cactuars and the, um, the challenge for Kid G, I think is his name. Yeah, this weirdo over here. Sure took you long enough. What do you say? Want to jump right into your second trial? Hmm. You know how this ends. It's gonna be exactly the same, isn't it? <laughs> this sucks. Do I ever? But do you? Holy crap! Let's see. Who looks fit to fight? Okay, so it's gonna be different Ooh, people each yeah. time. Can I give it a go? <laughs> Fine by me. If the little lady wants to show off, I say let her. Hmm, she's gonna be a tough one. Aerith's Trial introduces two new species of Cactuars to conquer, Lightwars and Darktwars. Press L2 to conjure an anti-Lightwar Luminous Ward, and press R2 to summon an anti-Darktwar Shadow Ward. Basic attacks performed within these wards are more efficacious against the aforementioned Cactuars. Note the Cactuars of other affinities may appear going forward, so keep your elemental wits about you as you fight. Cool. Can you tell how excited I am? Okay then. Ready? Wait, do you do the same or the opposite? Ready? Get him! Okay, so you want to match. This one's for you! I'm backing off a bit. Go on! Hey, you asked for it. Here it comes! I'm backing off a bit. This should make you stronger. Go on! You asked for it. That's it. Here it comes. One more shot. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Yoo-hoo. Hey, you asked for it. Keep my distance if I were you. Oh, you suck, bro. Ready? Get him! This one's for you! And catch! One more shot! Go on! This one's for you! Hey, you asked for it. I'd keep my distance if I were you. This should make you stronger. One more shot! Run! I'm backing off a bit. Maybe this will do the trick. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Fuck you. I hate this game. Okay. <sighs> I think we got in our first tier at least, so we can move on and never do this ever again. Well, until we do the next one. We have to do it two more times, but you take my meaning. I don't care about the rewards for these. I don't like this mini game. Wow, you sure showed me. And I still thought you might be no better than a bunch of bumbling bandits. Ta-da! We done now? 
not even close. You've still got two more pieces to collect, and they won't come easy. Ah, but I could use a bit of time to shore up the next trial, seeing as you kind of breezed through the first two. How's about we put things on pause? Here, give me your contact info. That way, I can hit you up when the trial's good and ready. What? Cloud, I think it would be wise to oblige his request. Hmm, perfect. You'll be hearing from me soon. Peace. Our hunt is on hiatus? For the time being. I'm afraid our only viable course of action is to await further instructions. Okay, we need a rest. Okay, we need to hit that up. There's got to be a bench somewhere nearby here, I feel like. there's We haven't found one close. Yeah, there's probably one here somewhere or over here somewhere. Maybe as far as here? Either way, we need to get this still. that one we've gotten? No, that's not even a chocobo stop. Never mind. Okay, so it looks like it's up on the cliff. What are you doing your combos, dude? Getting her up to prey is really difficult. Her ATB gain is just so slow. Okay, so there it is. Damn, if I'd noticed that earlier, I sh would have go gone and gotten it, but it's my bad.
Okay, what pathway do you want me to go, bro? How do I get there? <laughs> really? Alright, now I'm just getting annoyed, though. Like, for real, though. Why are you- why? Just why? <laughs> Just why? Alright, is there a pathway down here? Ignore the enemies. All right, cool. Thanks, bro. Thought he was going to jump off again. <laughs> Oh, the chocobo takes a rest with you. That's so cute. Never noticed that before. Okay, two treasure chests here. <laughs> if he's over there just jumping on shit, gotta love it. in here, right? Yeah. Which means we'll be outnumbered. 
Oh, is the Tonberry King we close to here or something? He probably is. And catch us in the crossfire. Uh, okay, what about Ziva? Uh, Thinking naughty thoughts. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Busted. I thought ninjas were supposed to be silent. Oh, forgive me for interrupting your fantasies. I'll let you get back to being her. Thank you. Thank you, Yuffie. God, that's all I ask, okay? Okay, so it must be inside here. Wait, really? Oh, there is a way back there, okay. Karmic Cow. Bro, bro, come on. There we go. Armor upgrade six. Okay, cool. <laughs> How did I not realize you could make them kick? If you push the attack button, they kick. Whack. Love that. Okay. So, transmuter. Got a bunch of new shit now. Now, I actually need more than one, don't I? So, how many locations were there? One, two, three. All right, so we need three. All right, now let's check on everything else. Supernatural wrist guards. Increases strength by 10%.
seriously. Now, this ends here. Gotcha. That's that. Self cake. Okay, we want to go to that. I wonder if you can return to these and ha and those items replenish or not. What do we think? We've never tried. I kind of doubt they would, though. But who knows? Maybe that's just their way of, like, giving you an easy way to not have to farm shit, you know? Get big collections all in one go. Might be worth checking out at some point, but... The Rise of the Gold Saucer. The tale of the Gold Saucer began with a Shinra employee named Dio, who convinced the company to build a museum called the Reliquary. Although it was doomed to failure, Dio was not to be deterred, and he set about finding the world's largest theme park, founding the world's largest theme park, which he first conceived as a small-scale fairground. In the wake of the Corel Mako reactor explosion four years ago, plans were set in motion to revitalize the local economy. Hearing this, Dio decided to relocate his fairground to the region, eventually transforming it into a state-of-the-art entertainment complex. Now known as the Gold Saucer, it is powered by several modular reactors, which are responsible for the surrounding area's accelerated desertification. In light of this, the reactors are now run at minimum output in an attempt to mitigate further damage to the environment. Yeah, I think the major damage has already been done. Okay, we've already kind of ventured back there. We haven't ventured over here. We've got to get this, which, um... Yeah, just looking at this, this might be a way up, but... Yeah, we kind of got lost on that one. You know what, maybe what we do is we go here, and then maybe whatever this thing is that's across will help us get across that way. Maybe? Maybe. Show me where it's at, little guy. Nice little view f for this place. <laughs> Yeah, let's go check out whatever this is. I wonder if this would... Yeah, that's so far away, I doubt that... Hmm, maybe there's like a quest 
here or something. It might be one of the reactor quests that we haven't unlocked yet, although that's pretty close to one of the other ones, so maybe, maybe not. Or maybe this is where that kid G or whatever is going to send us eventually when he calls us. There's certainly going to be something here. If not now, then later. Side quest. Something with Chadley we haven't unlocked yet. Something. We're going to end up fighting Sand Daddy here or something. How much you want to bet? here. Yep, there's also that. Right around this corner? Yeah, probably on that tree right there. Think we ought to do something for Cloud Junior, don't you? Oh yes. Kids gotta eat. Kids gotta eat. Oh, what a what a good dad. What a good dad you are for your son. Setting a trap for him. <laughs> We wait. Might as well rig the other traps then. Life was a hell of a lot simpler back in old Midgar. We were good. Okay, so how we do we cross? We ah, here we are. So what's changed? Not a damn thing. Shinra's still going down. We're coming back here. I see how I got tunnel vision. And not because Shinra was all I had to think about. It's because I didn't want to think about anything else. Saving the planet's important, but I put a lot of personal stuff on the back burner. And I shouldn't have. Nine and the others helped give me that clarity. Just wish I could have got it sooner. Get ready. Make way for the amazing you. <laughs> Brace yourself. Keep it together. If you're in this. Wanna beg for mercy? Can't see. There we go. <laughs> All right, we found it. Let's 
Square, circle, circle. Square, circle, circle. Pretty good progress on this side. Let's go here. Yeah, Tifa. Tifa's the kind of girl who can change a man. No doubt about that. He really set me straight, especially as a parent. Oh. have the father I am today without her. That's so. Tifa's kind of like What'd a mom do? to her too. Oh, got fed up with my bullshit and tore me a new one. <laughs> Started yelling about how a kid like Marlene needed a proper roof over her head, somewhere safe and clean. Said sleeping outside was risky. She was right. Yeah. Sure was. And not just her. The whole team helped me get my act together. I used to be a runaway train, charging full speed ahead and dragging folks along for the ride. Never thought about hitting the brakes or anything else. Had my fair share of crashes and went off the rails a few times. Caused a lot of trouble for those guys. Well, I'd say you managed to get yourself back on track. I couldn't have done it without it. Look at Cloud. Into my life for a reason. Like you did, Cloud. He's actually being like supportive of the team. I know it in my heart. He didn't let it out that often, but every once in a while. He says some nice shit. Still doesn't it still doesn't excuse him for being a shithead most of the time, but. Uh, we love our shithead cloud, don't we? <laughs> he gets a pass. Not from g being given a hard time, though. We gotta give him a hard time every once in a while. Especially when he gives these girls some truly, truly awful dates. Well, that's the last of the traps. Our bird might have already been caught in one of the others. Only one way to find out. Check the other trap. All right, now we just go back, huh? Now this one. Okay, so it seems like it wants us to go to this one. Okay, a bunch of cactuar. Don't hold back. Why'd you change targets, bro? Let's do this. Let's finish this. Went through the trouble of making that trap, and look how they treated. What a waste. Disrespectful. Got more. Absolutely disrespectful.
Well, some stuff comes back at these places, huh? Junior we finally found our boy. Look. Oh, he's so scared. Get ready. <laughs> Immune to wind, to stone, petrify, I guess. Yep, yeah. okay. Inflicting enough ice damage when it uses inflame will pressure it. When its HP gets low, it will self destruct. Ow. Her cure. You can thank me later. How you like this? Is that all you've got? How about you? I'll fight this and fall for you. This one's a show to the All the money goes. I'm not trying to escape, bro. Come on. What do you want about? <laughs> you like this? Take it over. Back. 
falling ice. Keep it together. Here I go. Okay, definitely don't want Ifrit. Who do you have? I hate that I cannot check. How come you don't tell me? Tell me just what everybody has, for fuck's sake, why? So dumb. Okay, what summon do you have? Sure, let's try Moogle Trio, why not? to child. Oh, is that your way of saying you're good on your own? But go straight home. You hear me? Flew off towards North Corral. All right, bye, buddy. Woo, we were hurting there, weren't we? There is more up there. You know, Cloud, just between you and me, I really, really like Alexander. <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't? A giant robot. I sometimes contemplate doing something wicked in the hopes I'm... <laughs> and he's cut off. Oh, good. <laughs> Take that, Chadley. Circle X, circle, circle X, circle. Circle X, circle, circle X, circle. Thank you. Ah, though you have yet to obtain the requisite materia, as I recall, 
You'll first need to confront the Divine via the Combat Simulator. Okay. So, let's head to... Corel to turn this in. You guys know that name. Of course he did. When we found him, we said, your friends are looking for you. You head straight home. <laughs> no wonder. Thank you so much. Hey, just doing a job. Go on, Ooh, eat up. Another level boost. You're gonna be so now we're up to, what, three of those? All the monsters. Hope I can bring Marlene back here one day. Tell her about her home and everything else. Uh, you sure that's a good idea? I owe it to her father. You'll feel better, maybe, but how do you think she'll feel? Don't know, man. <sighs> What's up? My dad says we're supposed to stay away from you. Sorry. That's so. <laughs> well, don't want to get you in trouble. Us old fellas gotta go. Take care, Cloud Jr. Thanks again for all your help, mister! Don't mention it. All right. A little bit closer with Barrett. All right, where is the inn here again? Let's see, right down there. Take whatever beds are. It's time you moved on. Okay. What's going on here? Oh, you know the folks who came into town with Barrett. Sorry about all, you know. I know it can't have been easy seeing the way we talked to him. And still, he went and helped the youngins. Made us realize how foolish we'd been acting. Thing about the past is, it's gone. And it ain't coming back. And what really matters now is Corel's future. So we asked ourselves, what we might could do to work toward a better one. I'm sure you noticed that some boys from the prison set up shop in town. We turned a blind eye to them at first, but... No longer. It's high time they learned what happens when folks try to take advantage of us. You're welcome to watch their education in the bar if you want. Education? We those out of Corel prison. Folks are lining up to say hello. Some of them came up around here, believe it or not. Maybe one day they'll get their shit together. So join in her lament. James doesn't share in her rage. <laughs> okay. Um, we should see if the board in the Corel prison town has any um, any quests that aren't also on the board here. Your efforts have yielded. Perhaps you would like to use it to develop materia. Now we've unlocked some other ones too, it looks like. Yep, okay. Oh, skewer it. Vitality up materia.
All right, let's go, ladies. Oh, jeez. That guy's wasting no time. Get him! Okay, fire seems to be the common ground here. stuff. Okay, thunder on these guys. Wait, same fight again? Jesus Christ, dude. Guys absorb that, so don't do it on them. Watch yourself. Please, it always gonna be me. At least put up a fight. Run like a chocobo. Oh yeah! Now you're in. And one to grow on.
Hey, lightning and wind material improved. Those ones so take bad. a long time to level up too, so that's good. All right, I should check where my AP up is um, right now. See if I need to move it around. See if there's something else I want to target, you know? Uh, sand slithers. Okay, we need cloud for that one. Um, who else is gonna be good for that? There, let's bring in those three. Let's do some gravity. Let the true battle commence. That's an annoying fight, dude. Lots of weaknesses. Thunder isn't one of them, though. Together. Let's do this. Exploiting its elemental weakness will pressure it. While in this state, we'll erect a barrier in front of it and counter attack. How do I counter its counter? Gotcha. 
on you. Yeah! Time for a serious ass woman! Show them what's coming to mind now! These are some noxious fights. Mean setups. There didn't seem to be a counter to those blocks either. We're gonna have to do that again in the next one. I'm pissed. I'm actually annoyed by that, but it's fine. Um, man, those setups suck. Because the best way to get them out of the ground is Cloud, and he keeps on getting eaten by that fucker. Um, okay. Um, in the next episode, we're gonna maybe look at I that again. I gather from your expression that you're eager for more. I wish you all the best in your ongoing hunt for world intel. Anyways, <laughs> thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Bye. I'd like to give a very special shout-out to my patron supporters, Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Vlada101, Andy Ford, Bruce Wizzle, Black Mamba90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, Pedo Kuto, Shadow Raven, Anna Kate the Great, Emily Kuzanoa, Philip Doughty, Timothy Jansen, Skip, Daniel, St. Germain Soleil, and Nadia N. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.